Chandra Pop. Some fact about his life and notable work through MCQs and with analysis. So let's start. These are some notable books. Question number one. When was Alexander Pop born? 1681, 1690, 1688, 1692. Correct answer. Option number C. 1688. Born in London. 21st of May in England. Next, Alexander Pope belonged to which century? Early 18th century, late 18th century, early 19th century, late 19th century. Correct answer? Option number A, early 18th century. Pope's The Dunciad comprises of one book, two books, three books, six books. Correct answer? Option number C, three books in The Dunciad. Dunciad is a landmark, mock heroic narrative poem. Next question. Which type of poetry Alexander Pope is best known for? Historical, historical and discursive type of poetry. Heroic, free verse. Correct answer. Option number B. Historical and discursive type of poetry. Pope is considered a master of heroic couplet, free verse, historical, rhyme royal. Correct answer. Option number A. Heroic couplet. He is a master of. Alexander Pope, born on 21st of May 1688, died 30 May 1744 at the age of 56. Resting place, St. Mary's Church and Middlesex. Occupation, poet, writer and translator. Notable work, The Dunciate, Rape of the Lock and Assumed Criticism. He translation of Homer's Iliad and Odyssey. Next question. Pope's major translation work. Iliad, Odyssey, both A and B, none of above. Correct answer. Option number C, both A and B. Iliad and Odyssey translated by Alexander Pope. Brave of the Lock is a dash type of poem. Heroic couplet, styrical, rhyme royal, mock heroic. Correct answer. Option number D, mock heroic. Published in 1712. To are is human to forgive divine. The above quote is taken from which work of the Pope? An essay on criticism, the Dunciad, pastorals, the ape of the log. Correct answer, option number A, an essay on criticism. Alexander Pope belongs to which period? Modern, Augustan, Victorian, Georgian. Correct answer, option number B, Augustan period. Augustan is, is also known as the Renaissance period, New Classical period, Old English, Middle English period. Correct answer, option number B, New Classical period. New Classical literature was written between 1660 to 1798. This age is also known as Age of Reason. First major poetic work of Alexander Pope, Anasion Criticism, The Pastorals, The Dunciad, Anasion Man. Correct answer. Option number B. The Pastorals. Pastorals published 1709. It's a Pope's first major work. When was an Asian criticism published? 1721, 1711, 1718, 1709. Correct answer. Option number B. 1711. Written by Alexander Pope. Pope was a member of which reputed club of Augustan age, Bloomsbury Group, English Literary Club, University with Sacribles Club, correct answer, option number D, Sacribles Club, founded in 1714. Who wrote Ode on Solitude? Alexander Pope, Jonathan Swift, Thomas Parnell, John Kay, correct answer, option number A, Alexander Pope, wrote Ode on Solitude, it is a point. Next, when did Alexander Pope die? 1746, 1744, 1748, 1740. Correct answer, option number B, 1744. Next, when was Asian Man published? 1724 to 25, 1736 to 37, 1732 to 31, 1733 to 34. Correct answer, Option number D, 1733 to 34. 
an essay on man published contained very deep and well thought out of the philosophical idea to whom alexander pope dedicated his an essay on man henry st john henry ford john ford john st john correct answer option number a henry st john an essay on man dedicated by alexander pope Vindicate the ways of God to man is taken from which poem of Pope? An essay on man, the Dunciad, the rape of the log, an essay on criticism. Correct answer, option number A, an essay on man. Who is addressed by Pope in the poem Epistle to Dr. Arbutnot? John Arbutnot, Sam Arbutnot, Jack Arbutnot, Jill Arbutnot. Correct answer, option number A, John Arbutnot. Which famous poem was written by Pope at the age of 12? Messiah, Ode on Solitude, The Temple of Fame, Alisa to Avlad. Correct answer, option number B, Ode on Solitude. Written by Pope at the age of 12, in the year of 1700. When was Pope's The Works of Mr. William Shakespeare published? 1730, 1735, 1725, 1740. Correct answer, option number C, 1725, the works of Mr. William Shakespeare published. The works of Mr. William Shakespeare has total dash volume, 6, 7, 8, 9. Correct answer, option number A, total 6 volume in works of Mr. William Shakespeare. What type of work moral essays is? Essays, poem, plays, novels. Correct answer. Option number B. Poems. Moral essay is a poem published between 1731 to 1735. How many poems are included in moral essays? 5, 3, 6, 4. Correct answer. Option number D. Total 4 poems are included in moral essays. Which of the following work is not written by Alexander Pope? The Dunciad, The Rape of the Law, An Essay on Criticism, Paradise Lost. Correct answer, option number D, Paradise Lost. Written by Milton. It is an epic poem in a blank words. Which of the following poem of Pope was translated into Latin by Samuel Johnson, Messiah, Ode on Solitude, The Temple of Fame, Alisa to Ablard. Correct answer. Option number A. Messiah. Messiah written in 1712 and translated into Latin in December 1728 by Samuel Johnson. Christopher Marlowe's detailed summary and some important fact about Christopher Marlowe. So let's start. These are some important books. Edward II, The Passionate Shepherd to His Love, Hero and Lander, The Death of Marlowe. When was Christopher Marlowe born? February 26, 1564, January 26, 1564, March 26, 1564, April 26, 1564. Here correct answer. Option number A, February 26, 1564. Christopher Marlowe was an English poet and a Shakespeare's most important predecessor in the English drama. Born 26 of February 1564 in the Canterbury, Kent in England and died 30th of May 1593. What was the profession of Marlowe's father? Goldsmith, blacksmith, shoemaker, carpenter. Correct answer. Option number C. Shoemaker. Marlowe's was the second child and the eldest son of John Marlowe. John Marlowe. A shoemaker by a trade and his shop was also located in the parish. Next question. Which technique was first used by Marlowe in his plays? Free words, compact style, blank words, imagery. Here correct answer. Option number C. Blank words. Christopher Marlowe was the first English author to achieve critical notoriety for his use for blank words. In which year Marlowe obtained his Bachelor of Arts degree? 1570, 1590, 1584, 
95. Here correct answer. Option number C, 1584. Who referred Christopher Marlowe as a famous gracer of tragedian? William Shakespeare, Robert Greene, Edmund Spencer, Thomas Nash. Here correct answer. Option number B, Robert Greene. First play written by Christopher Marlowe, Hero and Neander, Edward II, Queen of Catherine, Chamberlain the Great. Correct answer. Option number D. The Chamberlain the Great. First play written by Christopher Marlowe. Written in 1587. Published 1590. Next question. How many total parts written in the play Chamberlain the Great? 2, 3, 4, 5. Correct answer. Option number A. It is in a two part. Which was the first play written in a blank words by the Christopher Marlowe, Edward II, Dr. Faustus, Tamburlaine the Great, the Zoo of Malta? Correct answer. When was Dido, Queen of Carthage, published? 1600, say 1590, 1586, 1594. Correct answer. Option number D, 1594. Dido, Queen of Carthage. In the full, the tragedy of Dido, Queen of Carthage, the play in a five act by the Christopher Marlowe and the Thomas Nash. Next question Who was Marlowe's co writer for Dido, Queen of Carthage, Thomas Nash, Thomas Kidd, Shakespeare, T.S. Eliot? Correct answer Option number A Thomas Nash was a Co-writer for the QNF cartridge, written in 1594. How Dido dies at the end of Dido, Queen of Carthage, prolonged illness, got murdered, natural death, kills herself. Correct answer. Option number D. Kills herself. The play is based on the story of Dido and INS as told in the fourth book of Virgil's Aeneid. In the play Dido, the queen of Catherine is in love with the Aeneas. What was the name of Malta's Jewish merchant in the play The Jew of Malta? Tamburlaine, Dr. Foster's, Mephistopheles, Barbaras. Correct answer, option number D, Barbaras. The Jew of Malta, the full title, Famous Tragedy of Rich Jew of Malta as a play by Christopher Marlowe, written 1589. Which one of the following works is not written by Christopher Marlowe? The Jew of Malta, The Fairy Queen, Edward II, Tamburlaine. Correct answer. Option number B. The Fairy Queen is not written by Christopher Marlowe. It is written by Edmund Spencer. Christopher Marlowe is also known as Kit Marlowe, Kit Marlowe, Kit Munro, King Marlowe. Correct answer. Option number B. Kit Marlowe. Which greatest dramatist was contemporary of Christopher Marlowe? T.S. Eliot, William Shakespeare, John Dryden, Samuel Beckett. Here correct answer. Option number B. William Shakespeare was a contemporary of Christopher Marlowe. What is the full title of Marlowe's play, The Jew of Malta, Tragedy of the Jew of Malta, Tragedy of Rich Jew of Malta, Famous Tragedy of the Rich Jew of Malta, The Story of Rich Jew of Malta. Here correct answer. Option number C. The Famous Tragedy of Rich Jew of Malta is the full title of The Jew of Malta. Which was Christopher Marlowe's incomplete work when he died? Tamburlin the Great, Hero and Neander, Edward II, Queen of Carthage. Correct answer. Option number B. Hero and Yander. Incomplete work by Christopher Marlowe. Who has completed Hero and Yander after Marlowe's demise? Thomas Kitt, William Shakespeare, John Marston, George Chapman. Correct answer. Option number D. George Chapman completed Hero and Yander after Marlowe's demise. Christopher Marlowe belongs to which period? Elizabethan, Victorian, Modern, Contemporary. Correct answer. Option number A. Elizabethan period. Which period is known as Elizabethan era? 1500 to 1520, 1560 to 70, 
1558 to 1603, 1558 to 78. Correct answer, option number C, 1558 to 1603, known as Elizabeth Nuria. Marlowe's poem, Hero and Yandere, is based on Greek legend, French legend, British, Irish legend. Correct answer, option number A, Greek legend. Marlowe's Tamburlaine the Great, which type of work? Play, poem, essay, novel. Correct answer, option number A, it is a play. How many parts the Tamburlaine the Great is divided into? 3, 4, 2, 5. Correct answer, option number C, it divided into two part. Tamburlaine the Great is based on the life of Amir Temur, Aurangzeb, Edward II, Charles I. Correct answer, option number A, Amir Temur. Christopher Marlowe belongs to which century? 17th, 15th, 16th, 14th. Correct answer, option number C, belong to 16th century. Name the famous group Marlowe was a member of Bloomsbury Group, Graveyard Boys, University Wits, none of these. Correct answer, option number C, University Wits. Marlowe's piety line is phrase refers to compact style, blank words, imagery. Correct answer, option number B, it is a blank words. At what age did Christopher Marlowe die? 33, 29, 47, 54. Correct answer. Option number B. At the age of 29. Marlowe's tragedies are all one-man tragedies, revenge plays, love tragedies, tragedies of royals. Correct answer. Option number A. One-man tragedies. Who wrote the following play? The Jew of Malta, Tamberlin the Great, Dr. Foster, Hero Leander. Abner Spencer, Christopher Marlowe, Thomas Kidd, George Billy. Here, correct answer. Option number B, Christopher Marlowe. All these plays are written by Christopher Marlowe. The immediate source of Christopher Marlowe's Dr. Faustus is a Dutch narrative, French narrative, German narrative, none of these. Correct answer. Option number C, a German narrative. Victorian era's famous woman writer, Elizabeth Gaskell. Its full name, Elizabeth Claghorn Gaskell and pen name Cotton Mather Mills. These are the famous books. What was Elizabeth Gaskell's pen name? Options George Eliot, Charlotte Bronte, Mary Shelley, Cotton Mather Mills. Correct answer Cotton Mather Mills. She published in 1847 Libby Mars Three Eras in Howitt in the Journal under the pseudonym Cotton Mather Mills. So, correct answer Cotton Mather Mills. Its pen name. Next question, when was Elizabeth Gaskell born? Options 1809, 1810, 1812, 1819. So correct answer 1810. Elizabeth Gaskell born 29 September 1810 in the Chelsea, London. Died 12 November 1865 Hampshire in England at the age of 55 years. Pen name used Cotton Mather Mills, occupation novelist, biographer and the short story writer. Period belong to Victorian era, 1848-65. Spouse William Gaskell, children Mariana, Margaret Emily, Florence Elizabeth, William, Julia Bradford. Movies The Sins of a Father, The Followers and the Cousin Phyllis. Next question, what the reason for Elizabeth Gaskell's death? Options old age, heart attack, coronavirus and the scarlet fever. Correct answer, heart attack. She was having tea when she suddenly collapsed from a heart attack at the age of 55. Next question, what was the name of Gaskell's son in whose grief she began writing? Options, William, Stuart, Charles and Milton. Correct answer, William. In 1845, Elizabeth's only son, William, died of scarlet fever at the age of 9 months. Next question. Which was Elizabeth Gaskell's first novel? Options Mary Barton, North and South, Cranford, Ruth. Correct answer Mary Barton is Elizabeth Gaskell's first novel, published during 1848. Cranford published during 1851 to 53. Ruth published 1853. 
North and South published during 1854. These are the notable work. Mary Barton, A Tale of Manchester Life, its most important work, Cranford, Ruth, North and South, Sylvia's Lover, Wives and Daughters, The Haunted House, The Life of Charlotte Bronte is also most important. Next, Mary Barton, its first novel, published during 1848, belonged to genre novel, setting in Manchester, subtitled A Tale of Manchester Life. So main character, Mary Barton, Mrs. Mary Barton, George Wilson, John Carson, Astro. The main story, the story is set in the English city of Manchester between 1839 to 1842 and deals with the difficulties faced by Victorian working class. Next question, Mary Barton describes the living conditions of factory workers in which British city? Options, London, Hull, Glasgow, Manchester. Correct answer, Manchester. The factory workers were living in wretched conditions and Elizabeth wants to let upper classes know about their problems. Next question, what is the original profession of the heroine in Ruth? Options, doctor, nurse, dressmakers, assistant, shopkeeper. So, correct answer, dressmaker's assistant. Ruth is a young orphan girl and works as an apprentice at a seamster shop. Next question, who was Ruth's illegitimate son? Options, John, William, Leonard, Hogarth. Correct answer, Leonard is Ruth's illegitimate son. Ruth published during 1853 in a three volumes, belong to genre, social novel, main characters Ruth Hilton, Henry Bellingham, Leonard its illegitimate son, Mr. Bradshaw, a local businessman. The story deals with the Victorian views about sins and illegitimacy. Ruth goes on to gain a respectable position in the society as a governance. Next question. Cranford portrays what type of life in the tiny English village? Options. Funly and lightful, sad and miserable, rich and wealthy. There are none of above. Correct answer. Funly and lightful. The story focuses primarily on the town's single and widowed middle class female inhabitants who are comfortable with their traditional ways of life and place great store. Next question in which year Can Ford published? Options 1851 to 53, 1850 to 51, 1863 to 64, 1855 to 57. So correct answer 1851 to 53. Cranford set in the fictional village of Cranford. Main characters Mary Smith, Mrs. Matty, Deborah, Jenkins, Dr. Hawkins and Martha. So it was first published irregularly in the eight installments between December 1851 to May 1853 in the magazine Household words which was edited by Charles Dickens. Later in 1853 it was published in book form. Next question, who is narrator in the Cranford? Options Dr. Hawkins, Deborah Jenkins, Mary Smith, Miss Matty. Correct answer Mary Smith is the narrator of in the Cranford. Next question, Elizabeth Gaskell wrote the biography of which writer? Options, Emily Bronte, Jane Aston, Charlotte Bronte, George Eliot. Correct answer, Charlotte Bronte. The Life of Charlotte Bronte, 1857, is the posthumous biography of Charlotte Bronte by Elizabeth Gaskell. On the request of Charlotte's father, Patrick Bronte, she decided to pen biography. Next question, 
North and South was published in magazine. Name the editor of that magazine. Options Charlotte Bronte, Jane Aston, George Eliot, Charles Dickens. So correct answer is Charles Dickens. Charles Dickens was the editor of that magazine. Next North and South is published during 1854. Belong to genre social novel. Set in the fictional industrial town of Milton. These are the main characters, Margaret Hill, Edith Shaw, Dixon, and Captain Lennox. So plot, the Margaret Hale is the heroine of the novel, forced to leave her home in the Tranquil. Tranquil in the rural south settles with her parents in Milton. She witnessed the brutal world wrought by the Industrial Revolution, seeing employers and the workers clashing in the first strike. Next, Gaskell wanted to title the novel North and South, what the other name initially, what was that? Options, Margaret Hill, Churchwoman of Milton, South and North, Milton, Northern. So correct answer, Margaret Hill. Margaret Hill is the title of North and South, initially name was given. Next, what is Edith doing at the opening of the novel? Options, talking, eating, sleeping and getting dressed. So correct answer, sleeping. Edith is doing sleeping at the opening of the novel. Next, Edith aid Margaret's. Options, sister, cousin, friend and aunt. So correct answer, cousin. Edith is the Margaret's cousin. Next question, which is Elizabeth Gaskell's incomplete work? Options, Cranford, Wives and Daughters, North and South, The Haunted House. So correct answer is Wives and the Daughter is an incomplete work by the Elizabeth Gaskell. Wives and Daughter, the title of an, an everyday story. The published during the 1864 to January 1866 in a serial form and in Cornhill magazine. So belong to the genre novel set in the Hollingford town in the 1830. So main characters Molly Gibson, Cynthia Kirkpatrick, Mr. Gibson. Most important characters. So plot, the wives and daughter, the unfinished novel by the Elizabeth Gaskells. So we previously discussed in the slide is set in the small English town. It focuses on a young woman named Molly Gibson who lives with her widowed father, a country doctor. Next question, who has completed Elizabeth Gaskell's Wives and Daughters? Options, Ludwig Rehrbach, Mary Elizabeth, Molly Gibson, Frederick Greenwood. So correct answer is Frederick Greenwood. With the help of Frederick Greenwood, Elizabeth Gaskell complete their work and died suddenly 1865. Next question, Molly Gibson's character taken from which work of Gaskell's? Options, Wives and Daughter, North and South, Ruth, Sylvia's Lovers. So correct answer is Wives and Daughters. Molly Gibson is the character, main character in this novel. So next, which of Elizabeth Gaskell's novels was originally published anonymously? So options, Cranford, North and South, Wives and Daughter, Mary Barton. So correct answer, North and South. The published originally in the anonymously. Next question, who has completed Elizabeth Gaskell's Wives and Daughter? Next question, which novel Gaskell said the saddest story I ever wrote? Options, The Life of Charlotte Bronte, Sylvia's Lover, My Lady Ludlow, and Round the Sofa. So correct answer is Sylvia's Lover. In, which, in this novel, the saddest story I ever wrote, Gaskell said about this. Next, Sylvia's Lover, published during 1863 and set in the coastal town of Monk Chevron in 1790s. So these are the main characters, Sylvia Robson, Daniel Robson, Molly Corney and Phillips. Philip is Sylvia's cousin. 
so this is the plot during this period the britain and the france were at war and the men of the monk heaven lived in fear of the press gangs who forced them into action against france next question name the coastal town in which silvius lover story begin options manchester monk heaven winchester nuts for so correct answer is monk heaven this is the coastal town where the silvius lover story begin next question the haunted house is a story published in which year options 1855 1850 1869 1859 so correct answer is 1859 haunted house the story published during this year and this is a weekly periodical all the year rounded in this it was conducted by the charles dickens and contributed contributions to the others next question oh i can't describe my home it is home and i can't put its charm into words the above quote is taken from which novel of the gaskell so mary barton north and south cranford wife and daughter so correct answer is north and south this quote is taken from north and south next which one of the gaskell's novel has been called a victorian much ado about nothing options ruth mary barton north and south the life of charlot front so correct answer is north and south so now we move on to revision of these questions i hope you learned so many important facts about elizabeth gaskell's life and this extra information is really really beneficial for your exams so now take a revision of these questions so let's start what was elizabeth gaskell's pen name cotton mather mills next when was elizabeth gaskell born born on 1810 next question what the reason for the alleged with gaskell's death it's a heart attack next what was the name of gaskell's son in the whose grief she began writing so its name william next question which was alleged with gaskell's first novel it's a mary barton next mary barton describes the living conditions of factory workers in which british city it's a manchester next what is originally profession of the heroine in the ruth it's a profession of dressmaker's assistant next question who was ruth's illegitimate son it's a leonard next cranford portrays what type of life in the tiny english village in the life of funly and the delightful next question in which year cranford published it's published during 1851 to 53 next question who is narrator in the cranford it's a mary smith next elizabeth gaskell's wrote the biography of which writer the writer of charlotte bronte next question north and south was published in magazine name the editor of that magazine the editor's name charles dickens next question gaskell wanted to title the novel north and south with other name initially what was that it's a margaret hale the first initial name given north and south next question what is adit doing at the opening of the novel she is sleeping next adit is margaret she is cousin next which is elizabeth gaskell's incomplete work elizabeth gaskell's incomplete work wives and daughters next question who has completed elizabeth gaskell's wives and daughters its name is frederick greenwood next question molly gibson's character taken from which work of gaskell's the wives and daughter molly gibson taken the character this work next question which of elizabeth gaskell's novels was originally published anonymously anonymously published north and south next question who has completed elizabeth gaskell's wives and daughter it's a frederick greenwood question is repeated here next which novel gaskell said 
the saddest story I ever wrote. It's a Sylvia's Lovers. Next. Name the coastal town in which Sylvia's Lover story begins. The town name, Bankshavan. Next. The Haunted House is the story published in which year? Answer, The Haunted House published during 1859. Next. Oh, I can't describe my home. It is home and I can't put in its charm into words. So this is the quote. So this quote taken from the novel North and South. Next, which one of the Gaskell's novel has been called a Victorian much ado about nothing? It's a North and South. George Eliot's life and important work with question answer. So let's start. This is George Eliot important books. So my first question is what was the pen name of Mary Annie Evans? Options George Eliot, Mary Evans, T.S. Eliot, George Evans. Correct answer George Eliot. Next question why did Mary Ann Evans write under the name George Eliot? Options at that time writing was considered a male profession. She was living a disguise as a man she considered herself a man in a woman's body. She wanted quality of for man and woman. So correct answer. At that time, writing was considered a male profession only. So Mary and Evans used pen name George Eliot. Next question. When was Mary and Evans born? Options 22 November 1819, 14th May 1799, 1st October 1820, 5th January 1821. Correct answer 22 November 1819. Some in information regarding George Eliot. Born 22 November 1819. Warwickshire. Died 22 December 1880. Chelsea, London. At the age of 61 years. Resting place Highgate, Smetry. Pen name George Eliot. Occupation, novelist, poet, journalist, and translator. Period belonged to Victorian age. Spouse, John Cross. Partner, George Henry Lewis. Brother, Isaac Evans. Next question. Whom did Mary Ann Evans marry? Options, George Lewis, John Cross, John Chapman, John Stuart Mill. Correct answer, John Cross. Next question. George Eliot belongs to which era? Options, Romantic period, Modern period, Victorian era, Renaissance period. Correct answer, Victorian era. Next question. Which book of Ludwig Froback was translated by Mary Ann Evans and published in 1854? Options, The Kingdom of God is Within You, Either or, Essence of Christianity, why I am a Christian? Correct answer. Essence of Christianity. Next. Notable work. Adam Bad, The Mill on the Floor, Silas Marner, Romola, Felix Holt, Middlemarch, and Daniel Rona. These are the most famous work. Next question. Which novel was written first by Marianne Evan? Options. Adam Bad, Scenes of Clerical Life, Daniel Rona. Ramola. Correct answer. Adam Bad. Published 1859. Adam Bad published during 1859 belonged to genre historical. Setting of the novel fictional village of Hayslow. Main characters Adam Bad, a carpenter, and the main protagonist of the novel, Dinas Morris, is a Methodist preacher who seeks to bring God's love to all those around her. Hattie Sorrell, a beautiful young girl. Captain Donnie Thorne and the Captain Arthur is the grandson of local square. The story revolves around love triangle of above characters. Next question, who was Adam's profession? Options, a carpenter, a goldsmith, a hawker, a teacher. Correct answer, a carpenter. Next question, Tom Tulliver is character from which novel of George Eliot? Options, Romola, Scenes of Clerical Life, 
Daniel Deroda, the mill on the floors. Correct answer, the mill on the floors. About fact, belong to genre psychological fiction, domestic fiction and autobiographical novel. Setting fictional town of St. Oog is in the mid-summer. Publication date 1860 and the three volume main characters Maggie Tulliver, Tom Tulliver, Philip Eckham, Mr. Riley. The story of spanning a period of 10 to 15 years, the novel details the lives of Tom and Maggie Tulliver. Sibling growing up at Dold Court Mill on the river floors. Next question. Which one of George Eliot's novel has its subtitle The Weaver of Pablo? Options The Adam Bed, Silas Marner, Daniel Ronda, and Romola. Correct answer Silas Marner. Published during 1861, belonged to genre domestic fiction. Main character Silas Marner, Godfrey Case, Happy, Nancy Case. The novel is set in the early 19th century. Silas Marner is a weaver and the member of a small Calvinist congregation in. Lantern Yard in England, and he is falsely accused of stealing the congregation's fund. Next question The epigraph of Silas Marner is taken from whose poem? Options William Wordsworth, T.S. Eliot, P.B. Shalley, and John Keats. So, correct answer William Wordsworth. The title page includes the novel subtitle The Weaver of Ravlo. This epigraph is wrong. Wordsworth poem Michael. Next question. A new doctor arrives in middle March. What is his name? Ladislaw, Bulstrode, Fairbrother, Lidgate. Correct answer, Lidgate. Middle March, a study of the provincial life, belonged to genre realism and historical events, mostly set in fictitious England, Midlands town. Time, September 1829 to May. 1832 published during 1871 and 72 in eight volumes main characters dorothea brooke celia brooke tertia lidgate edward casborn mr arthur brooke the dorothea's uncle next question what is the name of mr brooke's estate options stipton lovis freshet Stone Court. Correct answer. Tip. Next question. Who is Dorothea least like in character? Options Celia, Rosamond, Mary, Harriet. Correct answer. Rosamond is the least like character. Next question. Who at the beginning of the novel says I shall never love anybody. I can't love people. I hate them. Options Gwendolyn, Mrs. Glasher, Grandcourt, Daniel. Correct answer Gwendolyn says these lines in the last novel of George Eliot, Daniel Rona. So, published during 1876, set in the fictional town Lebron in the Germany. Main characters Daniel Rona. And the Gwendolyn. Next question. What is Gwendolyn doing the first time Daniel sees her? Options. Gambling. Singing. Gardening. Painting. Correct answer. Gambling. Gwendolyn doing gambling when the Daniel sees her. Next question. When was Mola published? Options. 1860-61. 1871 to 72, 1862 to 63, 1872 to 73. So, correct answer is 1862 to 63. Romola is published. It's a fourth novel of George Eliot, belong to genre historical, and the set in the city of Florence during 15th century. Main characters Romola D. Birdie and the Tito Lemma. Next question. The George Eliot novel Romola is set in which city? Options Milan, Venice, Florence, the Papal States. Correct answer Florence. 
George Eliot's novel Romola published in the city of Florence. Next question, these are the famous quotes. Who said these quotes? I wish every book in that library was built into a catacomb for your master. Who said these line? Options, Mr. Brook, Pratt, Tantrip, Ladislaw. So correct answer, Tantrip said to Pratt in the George Eliot's Middlemarch. Next quote, I suspect you of being an adroit flatterer. Options, Rosamund Vincy, Celia, Mary Gart, Mr. Ned, Flammerdale. So correct answer, Rosamund Vincy said to Mr. Ned in the George Eliot's novel Middlemarch. Next question, which of these statements about Romola is not true? Options, it is written by George Eliot. It was published in 1863. It is a historical novel set in the Florence during the 1490s Renaissance. Tito is a Romola servant in the novel. So correct statement is Tito is a Romola servant in the novel. It's not true about the Romola. All other facts are correct about the Romola novel. Next question. Consider the following statements. The main characteristic of the atom beds are. It is written by George Eliot and is her first novel. Dina Morris is not a character in the novel. It is set in the town of Lomshire. It is a pastoral novel. So options are A and B, A and D, C and B and C and D. So these are the correct option A and D. It is written by George Eliot and is her first novel and it is a pastoral novel. These statements are correct about the Adam Birds. Next question. Dina Morris is a character in George Eliot's novel. Options Middlemarch, Silas Marner, Daniel Ronda and Adam Bats. So correct answer Adam Bat. Dina Morris is a character from George Eliot's novel Adam Bats. Next question. Put the following novels of George Eliot in a sequence order. So modern uh, novels are Middlemarch, Daniel Ronda, Felix Holt and Amola. So these are the uh, options. So correct answer is Ramolla published 1862, Felix Holt 1866, Middlemarch 1871 to 72, Daniel Roda published 1876. So correct option is B. Now we move on to next part, the quick reason of these questions. So let's start. First question is, what was the pen name of Mary Ann Evans, George Eliot? Next, why did Mary and events write under the name George Eliot because at that time writing was considered a male profession only. Next question. When was Mary Ann Evans born? Born on the 22 November 1819. Next question. Whom did Mary Ann Evans marry? With John Cross. Next. George Eliot belongs to which era? Victorian era. Next question. Which book of Ludwig? Fairback was translated by Mary and Evans and published in 1854. Book name Essence of Christianity. Next question. Which novel was written first by Mary and Evans? Novel Adam Bad. Next question. What was Adam's profession? Its profession a carpenter. Next question. Tom Tulliver is character from which novel of George Eliot? taken from the mill on the floors. Next question. Which one of the George Eliot's novels has as its subtitle The Weaver of Ravlo? Answer Silas Marner. Next question. A new doctor arrives in Middlemarch. What is his name? His name is Lydgate. Next question. What is the name of Mr. Brooks' estate? It's Tipton. Next, who is Dorothea least like in character? It's Rosamund. Next, who at the beginning of the novel says, I shall never love anybody. I can't love people. I hate them. It's said by Gwendolyn. Next, what is Gwendolyn doing the first time Daniel sees her? She is doing gambling. Next question, when was Romola published? During 1862 to 63. Next question. The George Eliot novel Romola is set in which city? Set in the Florence. 
नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन आई विश एवरी बुक इन दैट लाइब्रेरी वॉज बिल्ट इन टू अ कैटिकॉम फॉर योर मास्टर दिस लाइन सेट टू टेनी ट्रिप नेक्स्ट आई सस्पेक्ट यू ऑफ बींग एन एड्रॉइड फ्लैटर सेट बाय रोजमंड विंसी now we move on to quiz of these questions so write the answer of this question in a comment box below first question is what was the pen name of mary and ivan second question george eliot belongs to which era next question which novel was written first by mary and ivan next what is gwendolyn doing the first time daniel sees her Next, the George Eliot novel *Romola* is set in which city? Write the answer of these questions in a comment box below. Okay. In this class, we are going to discuss about Robert Browning, about his life and some important work through question answer and full analysis. So let's start. These are some important books written by Robert Browning: *Aslando*, *The Pied Piper of Hamelin*, *Man and Woman*, *The Ring and the Book*. First question is, when was Robert Browning born? These are options: seventh May eighteen sixteen, seventh May eighteen hundred eight, seventh May eighteen hundred twelve, seventh May eighteen hundred twenty. So the correct answer is option number C, seventh May eighteen hundred twelve. Robert Browning born in Camberwell in London. He was an English poet and playwright. His dramatic monologues and the psycho-historical epic. The Ring and the Book is a novel establish him as a major figure in the history of English poetry. Next question is Robert Browning belongs to which period? Options contemporary, Victorian, modern, renaissance. Correct answer option number B, Victorian period. He was come to be regarded as one of the most important English poets of Victorian period. Next question is Which one of the following is Robert Browning's first work? The Ring and the Book, Man and Woman, Pauline, Sordello. Correct answer. Option number C, The Pauline. Pauline is the first work written by Robert Browning, published in 1833 anonymously. The book is the confession of an unnamed poet to his lover. The eponymous woman. Robert Browning, born on seventh May eighteen hundred twelve in Camberwell, died twelfth of December eighteen hundred eighty nine at the age of seventy seven in Venice. Resting place: Westminster Abbey. Occupation: Poet, alma mater: University College, Lynn, London. Literary moment: Victorian period. Spouse: Elizabeth Barrett Browning. Married with eighteen hundred forty six, and she was died eighteen hundred sixty one. Children name Robert Wedman Barrett. Next question: Which one of the following points by Robert Browning, a man strangled his lover with her hair? Options: My Last Duchess, The Pied Piper of Hamelin, Andrea del Sarto, Porphyria's Lover. Correct answer: Option number D, The Porphyria's Lover. Porphyria's Lover. It is a poem published in eighteen hundred thirty-six. Describe being visited by his passionate lover, Porphyrias, after realizing how much she cares for him, and however the speaker strangles Porphyria, and then he props her lifeless body up beside him. Next question: What technique is used by Robert Browning in *My Last Duchess*? Dramatic monologue, lyric, narrative, epic. Correct answer option number A. Dramatic monologue technique used by Robert Browning in *My Last Duchess*, published in 1842. It is a poem, 56 lines. It is a classic example of dramatic monologue. Next question: How many rhyming couplets used by Robert Browning in his poem *My Last Duchess*? 28, 20, 24, 32. Correct answer option number E. Twenty-eight rhyming couplets used by Robert Browning. The poem is written in twenty-eight couplets in the iambic pentameter. The poem is set during the late Italian Renaissance. 
Next, which of the following points is included in the Robert Browning's dramatic lyrics? Options, the Pied Piper of Hamelin, the Porphyrius Lover, My Last Touches, All of Above. Correct answer, option number D, All of Above. Used by Browning, a dramatic lyric. Dramatic lyric published in 1842. It is a collection of English poems. All of the above poems, Porphyrius Lover, Pied Piper and My Last Touches are included in this self-published series, Dramatic Lyrics. These are some notable works, best poems, My Last Touches, Pied Piper of Hamelin, Porphyrius Lover, Heidi Roland to the Dark Tower, The Lost Leader, Meeting at Night, Fra Lippo Lippi, The Laboratory. Plays, Colmbay's Birthday, Victor, King Charles, Pippa passes in a balcony. Next question, what is the setting place of the poem Sordello? Options are England, Italy, Ireland, in Australia. Correct answer, option number B, in Italy. The setting in the northern Italy in 1220s dominated by the struggle between the partisans of Pope and the partisans of Holy Roman. Emperor. Next question Which one of the following poems is written by Robert Browning? Options to a skylark or to a nightingale, Fra Lipolipi, in memoriam. Correct answer Option number C, Fra Lipolipi, is written by Robert Browning. To a skylark is written by P.B. Shelley or to the nightingale, John Keats. In a memoriam written by Alfred Lord Tennyson. Next question The character Pompilia is taken from which one of the following works of Robert Browning? The Ring and the Book, Paracelsus, Man and Woman, or Slender? Correct answer Option number A The Ring and the Book. Pompilia Comparing was a 17 years old wife of. Count Guido, wife of Count Guido, bought as a newborn infant from a prostitute. Pompilia was brought up by aged foster parents, trapped in an incompatible marriage not of her choice. The Ring and the Book, published in four volumes, 1868 to 69. The Ring and the Book is a long dramatic narrative poem and more specifically a words novel, 21,000 lines. Next question, what is the name of Robert Browning's spouse? Elizabeth Hurley, Elizabeth Olsen, Elizabeth Barrett, Elizabeth Warren. Correct answer, option number C, Elizabeth Barrett. Married to Robert Browning in 12th of September. 1846, Elizabeth Barrett Browning was an English poet of the Victorian era, popular in Britain and the United States, United States during her lifetime. She was born on 6th of March, 1806. Next question, who is the speaker of My Last Duchess? Duke of Clarence, Duke of Bedford, Duke of Somerset, Duke of Ferrara. Correct answer option number D, Duke of Ferrara. Is the speaker of My Last Duchess. The poem is preceded by epigraph Ferrara, indicating that the speaker is most likely Alfonso, second DST, the fifth Duke of Ferrara. My Last Duchess is all about power, the political and social power welded by the speaker, the Duke and his contempt to control his marriage in the same way that he rules his lands. Next question, at what age Browning composed his first literary work? 12 years, 16 years, 18 years, 20 years. Correct answer, option number A, 12 years. When he was at the age of 12, he started writing. He learned to read and write at the age of just 5 years and composed his first literary work at the age of 12. Next question, which one of the following works is written by Robert Browning? 
the laboratory, the lost leader, only A, both A and B. Correct answer, option number D, both A and B, the laboratory and the lost leader, written by Robert Browning. The laboratory published in 1844 and the lost leader published in 1845. The laboratory, it is a poem and the dramatic monologue and published in the Hoods magazine and comic miscellany. Next question, which one of the following is included in the collection of Dramatis Persona? Rabbi Ben Ezra, My Last Touches, The Pied Piper of Hamelin, Sordello. Correct answer, option number A, Rabbi Ben Ezra. Rabbi Ben Ezra, poem written by Robert Browning and about uh, Abraham. Abraham Ibn Ezra. One of the great poets, mathematician, and a scholar of the 12th century and he wrote on grammar and astronomy. Dramatic Persona, it is a collection of poetry published in 1864. Next question, what is the plot of the Robert Browning's the ring and the book? Options are the finding the lost ring, murder trial, moral story, collecting books. Correct answer, option number B, murder trial. The books, the ring and the book tells the story of a murder trial in Rome in 1698. Next question. Ignorance is not innocence but sin. Who said above God? Robert Browning, Elizabeth Barrett, George Eliot, Thomas Hardy. Correct answer. Option number A. Robert Browning. Ignorance is not innocence but sin. Said by Robert Browning. Next question, Fra Lippo Lippi, written by Robert Browning, depicts which famous painter of 15th century? Options are Robert Campin, Simone Marmion, Filipino Lippi and Stephen. Here correct answer, option number C, Filipino Lippi. Fra Lippo Lippi is an 1855 dramatic monologue written by Victorian poet Robert Browning, which first appeared in his collection of men and woman so now we move on to at the end of this session so like share and subscribe my channel i hope you like this video and if you have any query then you can write me in a comment box below that's it for today see you soon for the next video till then bye